Oh man, so Robin Polo G is finally addressing the wild situation that's been going on between his mama and his sister online, dog. So if y'all don't know, I'ma catch y'all up with everything. But it's been documented back and forth between his mother and his sister. They've been arguing, and it stems from them having some beef, and the mother actually shooting at the sister while she was having an alleged psychotic breakdown. I'm referring to the sister. The mother responded by shooting at her to the scare away of a property. I'm gonna catch y'all up with all that, but but if you guys seen all that, this is Polo G's response to everything. He's on The Breakfast Club speaking with Charlemagne and DJ Envy. Here with Polo G, capital I gotta say, man. When you see family public issues spill over to social media, like, you know, everybody saw the situation between your mom and your sister. Mm -hmm. Do you intervene or do you let them work that up? For sure, I'm always intervening. It's like, I don't want to see no shit like that, you know? Mm -hmm. So I'm always try to get in between and before it go too far. That gotta what be you a mean go one. too far? They was fighting and shooting at each other. <laughs> this is Chicago. <laughs> this is Chicago. I might have to start adding Chicago with Florida. He said before it go too far. It was too far. They was fighting and shooting, Polo. Like, see, that's normal to Chicago people. <laughs> I don't know, that man. That is definitely normal to Chicago <laughs> you <know> people. <laughs> that was crazy. Is it even something that can be worked out? You think? Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. We family. I mean, I like. I feel like cuss who I am. That's it's it's just being broadcasted more, mm -hmm. and like everybody gonna talk about. It. But every everybody family go through go through shit like that. Shit, I'm accustomed to. I'm like, you know, minus I'm like, the shooting. No, right. that's normal to him. <laughs> <laughs> and, and how do you intervene? Because you can't pick a side. It's, it's like you almost got to just try to put them both in the room and be like, let's have this conversation. Yeah, that's that's definitely the angle to take because my sister, a pretty headstrong person. She, uh, she her mother child, you know? So you definitely got to be there. Have you tried that yet? Have you tried to have them work it out on the phone first, of course, because you don't want them in the room yet, but to, to try to get the, their feelings out and squash it because they mom and daughter it's something that i want to get around to but i'm definitely letting it breathe a little bit more right now i, mean, I just like i just like the energy that y'all bro I, I always like the cap a lot i liked watching y'all as, yeah. fa as a family unit you know what i'm saying yeah. i just thought that was dope mom helped managing the rapper son i just thought that was dope that's wild that's wild now nah. let's go ahead and get some help from the tiktoker if y'all want updates on tiktok from certain stories go ahead and follow school fool last sky but um, she has coverage on the situation. Let's go ahead and tap in. And Polo G, his sister Leilani, and their mother, Stasia. And last time we had them here, not only did Stasia leak messages of Polo G telling her he hated her, but she also leaked videos of her daughter Leilani having mental breakdowns. Now, here we are today, June 21st. And by the way, happy birthday, Stasia. Gossip of the City released footage of Stasia shooting at Leilani. You talk. In response to the leaked video, Stasia wrote, The greatest form of misery is to attempt to steal someone's joy. I'm not bothered, nor am I bothering nobody. The battle you're raging isn't with me, it's with yourself, Leilani. Mental health issues are real and so are boundaries. I can't still be the villain in your story. I'm not on to what y'all really want to know. You're damn right I blew that mother. Never said I didn't. Thought it was 16 shots. Another lie she told, another tear came out her eye because she manipulative and calculated. They were three warning shots to get an unstable person from my home where my baby and grandbaby were afraid and upset. While she was having a full on manic episode, I bet it got her ass off my property. And now y'all are wondering how she got the video. I sent it to her dad. The first time ever getting locked up was because of my mom. She antagonized him the same way she did me during a dispute. He attempted to retrieve his things and leave. She hired movers to discard all his belongings and move them to an undisclosed location. She at my brother. My brother happily waited for the police to arrive as he was a minor. She lied and said he broke into her house. When offered to drop the charges, she refused. He was placed on house arrest at a one-bedroom apartment. Had him living in somebody's closet. Introduced him to the penal system. So according to Leilani, what we are about to hear are voice notes from her mom, Stasia, that she sent to the family group chat. Get a gun jammed, and that's why you ended up in jail. Because after the gun jammed, with your scary 
ass. Where's my chain? Where is this? Where is that? Your weak ass was scared because your mama was going to fucking kill you. So let's talk about it. No shit. You know the mother gun jammed and you know you was gonna be over with now the young lady leilani the sister did speak more on the situation right here when she was um having a little a moment on live talking about it dog it took me a lot of a, a lot of points to get here i would my mom and on easter beat the dog out of her bro she a fake want to be fake birth i birth legends that you not none of that let's talk about it no, I don't get no Miana. I don't get no I don't care no more. I tore that ass up. Yes, I did. And I beat the baby mama ass too. Stop playing with me. I sat in court cases for my brother. I sat in literal, literal court cases for my brother. The house got raided. Bitch wasn't there. But you writing paragraphs on social media. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me, bro. Bro, this lady shot at me. She shot at me. She shot at Trench Baby. Like, like, like she shot at me 16 times. This lady, bro, this, my mom is so fucking narcissistic. Do not, first of all, you never even believed in my brother's career. When he even came, I'm the one that told you to like, no, no, Shaolin, I'm not doing that. Because this bitch want to post all of this shit on social media playing with me. Right, no, no, bro. Crazy as hell, dog. It really hurts when um, family bring they, they, they business to the streets, especially when people was looking up to them at some point in time. You had the mother managing her son, making the bread like crazy. And then also you had a situation with the other son that was kind of doing his thing as a rapper, but eventually he ends up going to jail for, um, I believe, robberies and things or alleged murders, I believe. I'm, I'm sorry, I gotta get up facts right on that. His name is um, Trench Baby. You got a sister having issues mentally. You got a mom spazzing out. And Polo G ain't put out no music and I don't know how long. It's coming soon though, but... <sighs> Hey, man, hopefully I can put it all together. Keep y'all business off the internet, though. But, um, hey, I would say you can't put all your trust and faith in, uh, in wanting to be like these people that you see online. Behind the scenes, they be having a lot of bullshit going on. This is one of the rare times that it actually hit front street, but a lot of times they have bullshit going on behind the scenes. Love yours. Appreciate your family. And be the best that y'all can be, man. Let me know what y'all got to say in the comment section below. I'm going to get up out of here, though. This is another update with Stace. Yo.